What a disaster. If the two heroes are flattened, then the opera is over. Then who will win the girl? Neither Draco nor Ralphs will save Rochelk. I, Rabble, the world's premier adventurer, will save her. I, uh, what awful acting. Silence, you are in the presence of Octopus Royalty, a low-born thug like you could never defeat me. Hmm, we might as well make the most of this music. Time no see, you've changed. Did you miss me? Okay, we're playing this smart now. We'll have them attack when he is looking. Uh, I suppose. Never mind. We'll just throw that straight out the window. That's Kappa status. Ah, oh, I can't use Blitz anymore. Uh, it looks like I need to use my sword technique more. At least. So much, or pretty much guaranteed 800. This is going horror than last time. Having fun? I'm pretty sound, Rabbi. I go a couple of this morning, so I'm kind of sleepy. Hey, I'm I'm in the same boat because you are so much of a strong one. Have you read it? Kappa pal, buddy. Oh no! Whatever will you do? Will I become? Okay. What an unlucky day. Adios. But yeah, that's fine, Light. I'm in the same boat I just recently woke up to. Ha 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 ha. Just a damn minute. So, now, we're gonna have Rochelle kidnapped. What a performance! <clears throat> I don't know why he spins her and she changes into her old clothes and not realize that that's Rochelle and not Maria. Dratness. I'm a man of my word, music man. That's him? What a reversal. Thinking she's Rabble's new queen, Maria is instead nabbed by Dratness. 
what fate lies in store for her. Stay tuned for Act 2. <sighs> this would be pretty impressive uh, to watch if I haven't already done so. But that's how things work with me sometimes. I'll deal with you in a minute. So... Knocking on the door. Winky face. Smuggles and friends. There's Luchi and Kuma and Rabble. What a performance. Enough already. But this is a tough one. Act 2 begins now. Where is Drachnus? He's coming, trust me. <clears throat> Who are you? You're not Maria. Dragness, we need your help. We have to go to Vector. We need the ship to get there. Look, if you're not Maria, I don't want you on board. Wait. We told you we were told your ship is the fi finest vessel in the world. And that you were the world's most notorious gambler. My brother's the King of Figaro. Cooperate and you'll be well rewarded. I'm one of Doma's warriors. Please help us. Come here. Yeah? Don't misunderstand me. I'm still not sure if I'm going to help you. Alright, so now... It's time to... bring back Luchi. And heal everyone up. And I keep forgetting that Luchi has magic, so he can do that for himself. Granted, he's nowhere as talented as Rochelle is when it comes to magic, but, you know, being innately starting with it does help. Phew, that empire's made me a rich man. Stop thinking for you of yourself, many towns and villages have been destroyed by the empire. The Empire is also totally corrupt. It's using magic to enslave the world. The Empire will end up owning you. I lost my friends and my family. The Empire. Evil? We all hate the Empire for the same reasons. That's why. You know, you're even more stunning than Maria. Hmm? Enough! you, if Rochelle will become my wife, I'll help. Otherwise... What? Are you insane? We haven't any choice. Yes, it's settled. But I have conditions. We'll decide what the twin costs. If it's heads, you'll help us, and we don't wed. If it's tails, I'll go with you, and we'll get married. Well, Mr. Gambler? Oh, -ho. fine. I accept. Listen to yourself, Rochelle. You can't become his wife. You just can't. That man uses people. Ready? How much you want to bet at the prela or at the end of this, those two end up actually getting together? We win. Now honor your part of the bargain. How unusual. The coin was identical sides. I think you've been hustled, Mr. Gambler. Ha! How low can you get? I love it! Alright, I'll help you. Nothing to lose but my life. My life is a chip in your pile. Ante up. Because, yeah, I imagine if both of those two end up living, it'd be so funny that they end up getting married in the end anyways. This unwieldy looking ship really moves. Could it crash? When things fall, they fall. It's all a matter of chance. This ship is gonna stand like a beacon. We best land some distance away. Right. I'll wait on board in case of an emergency. Alright, so since I've already seen this animation, I'll just uh, let it play. And I'll take care of something quick. We're going to the rave.
Alright, I'm back. And no di doubt light. I've definitely thrown a raven on the silent. Alright, since we talked to everyone here already, first things first, we're equipping Rochelle with her weaponry. Then, we're switching me and him now. You know what? We'll just buy six of them in order to have an even 20 high potions. And, out of the way. Right. Oops, shit. Let's see, already equipped with that. That was good. Basket sword. She did need that upgrade. Might as well pick that up for Kempi. Alright. I don't think we talked to this guy, though. Scholar weapons. A thousand years ago, during the worst War of the Magi, two so-called Ultima weapons existed. One changed a person's power into a sword, the other was a monster, bred for mass destruction. And I think I need to pick up that sword. I don't know, is this one of those Final Fantasies that had side quests available at the end? If so, I might want to look into that. Alright. Everyone needs a bard's hat. Except I can't afford it. Well, I could afford it. I just need to sell, like, everything. Speaking of which... Yeah. We can clean out our inventory a little bit. Or wait, no, no, no. It's... Well, at least the armors. Thing is, I know that Kempi could throw old weapons at the enemy and they do a bunch of damage, so I'm hesitant to sell them. And so thusly, wait a minute, I can't afford the headbands, but I suppose since they kicked my ass so heartily, we can grind a bit here <coughs> around this town. And while I'm at it, I might as well see how much it costs to stay at the inn, because I imagine I'm going to want to go there to replenish my health. Vector, capital of the Empire, is at the center of this continent. That's great. How about you let me get through there? Thank you. Alright. <laughs> Alright, 300 gil. Oh, I don't have my bot active. Um, but I'm going to save right now this way. And the other way. Uh, tell you what, hold on. Alright, bot is now active. So, yeah, from now on, you can tell me when you think I should save. So. And you also got the, uh, other things along with it. Joker. Some guy floating. Yeah, these guys hit hard. Seems like I can take a lot of damage as well. One magic point. Okay, so yeah. Each fight that we get into could possibly garnish us uh, the end times three. The night at the end times three.
Okay, preemptive attack. We're going to do back attacks. I'm just hoping he chooses the right one. Yes, he did. Fantastic. Michelle gained a level. Luchi gained a level. Every, Almost everyone gained a level. And we picked up a mythical rod. I don't know who can use it. So we'll just go down the list. Nope. 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 And uh, nope. Okay. Maybe it's in the desert where, like, it's most intense. Stone, not stoned. Just to clarify. Uh, Golden Needle. Yep. Or, most accurately, he was petrified. Well, let's see if I'll explore to the west first. Yeah, a little bit of icy hot. Some fire, or some blizzard and ice. Or blizzard and fire. And we'll just pick off the rest with regular so okay. I can't recall if that's a lot of experience from them. I don't know, uh, on average, how long it takes to beat Final Fantasy VI, but we seem to have been, or we seem to be in the 8 minute mark, or 8 hour mark. Uh, yeah, these, oh, oh, I know what these are, those... A little warm. That's not what they are. Half chicken, half snake. Yeah, if this was the eight minute mark, I would have a long way to go. But yeah, it's a mythical creature that can petrify people. Uh, wish I could remember the name of them, but. Body of a snake, chicken, or head of the chicken. Well, yeah, I suppose if in eight minutes I got here, or got to this point, that would be one health fast playthrough for me. But didn't you know, uh, Light? I've been, uh, I've been playing this on eight times speed. Ooh. You ugly brute, you better get out of here. Hold on, what's the name of this town? Or place? Capital Vector. Alright, uh, let's see. What do we got? Do you pledge your allegiance t to the Empire? Nope. What? Well, I suppose I asked for this, really. Oh, wow, what? Here I thought I was a in danger. 24 experience, 96 gil. What now, bitch? Right, I'm sure you can do it. <laughs> I swear, if the enemy is that strong, then yeah. Okay, so no new weapons over here. Let's see. 
armor. Headband, Bard's head. I can't afford four of them, but I would be poor as shit. Besides, we need, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven of them. Still holding off. General Rochelle turn traitor. Why? The other side is sure to lose. Sid, the director of Magitech Research, is a genius. He gave my child the gift of cured magic. You I've already talked to. Well, we may be seeing Sid soon. Hi, Light. Hard to you, too. Found the house. Have a snooze? Well, that's nice. Oh, well, thank you, Rochelle, for retweeting. That's very nice of you. How did I know that on the house was, like, not good? A thousand gills stolen. Well, that's one hell of a night at the inn. Oh my god, are you gonna keep saying that every time I see you? This is the Magitech Research Facility, no civilian entry. Hi, Volgacho. Welcome to the stream. Thank you for showing up. I greatly appreciate it. Shh. I'm a returner sympathizer. I heard of you. While I distract the soldiers, climb onto the steel tower from this box and enter the facility. Are you ready? No. Not yet. I want to explain. Hey, you! You're returners! Uh, let's see, are these guys as easy as... Hmm. Yeah, these guys aren't too threatening. Right, Lucci has no... attack magic. Why am I doing such weak damage to them? Fine, we'll do a rondo. Ah, uh, I'm doing okay, Volgacho. Thank you for asking. Uh, yes, how are you doing, Volgacho? Phew, that was close. Okay. Ah, that's good to hear, Volgacho. Glad you're doing well. Alright, Dawn. Apparently dogs are named Dawn now. I'm intrigued to see where the 5, 6, and s four, 5, 6, 7, and 8 go. Oh uh, yeah, I'm enjoying the game. There's a very good story to it. Uh, and I'm happy that I've made this my very first uh, sun or Saturday morning stream. Grass worm. That's not really a worm. Worms don't fly. that the Empire's on. <laughs> Who are the people that we're trying to take down? Just uh, give you an idea of the whole thing. I don't know, Vulgatra, have you ever played this game? I don't know if you have. So, yeah, have you an idea of the storyline behind this?
Because if not, I'll be happy to explain a bit of the storyline for you. Ah, poor bulldogs getting beaten because they. Because they decide to attack us in the middle of a field. Which made me wonder what it would look like in my mind, and then I just realized they did that with Final Fantasy XII. Which is another game that I own but never really played, so maybe at some point I can pick up a capture card and do that. I don't know, if people actually like my streams, then I might start investing more into them. Right now, I'm just doing it for the entertainment factor of myself and uh, of others. Which I'm glad that at least uh, you two are around. Miranda, I've been told that there's amazing weaponry here from some guy. 200 gil a night, that's even cheaper than the starting place. So that's good. Alright, what have we got going on over here? There's a clock, so we'll get the elixir. If I can. Okay, there is no one there. I suppose it has to be a grandfather clock. Alright. Miranda used to be this continent's most beautiful town. Look what the Empire's done to it. Yeah, it seems as though all the towns around the Empire are dilapidated. These troops are crazy. How long can things keep going on like this? Get out of my way. I want to buy stuff. Let's see. There's the Bard Hat. Oh, man. Mithril Mail. You guys are going to break the goddamn thing for me. The equipment, optimize, optimize. My son's being forced to serve in the Empire's military. Oh my god, that is a dog fighting ring. Tizen and Albrook, too, fell to the Empire. Tizen is another place we were told has amazing weaponry. Place all bets here. No! Gossip floating around here. My dog's the fiercest. Why? This is horrible. Why would you f have dog fights? Say, so, do you want to get hitched? What? I all say no. Or wait. I see ya, no. Uh, I just got proposed for marriage. That's interesting. My love hasn't sent me back any letters since he's been gone. I'm sick with worry. Wait a minute, could this be the woman of that fallen soldier in that one town? I wonder. <laughs> 